Hey guys, it's me, Claude GS. I'm going to do a little fish tour. Everyone's asking, is that a saltwater tank? Can we see them? And I've been like thinking, and I'm like, okay, sure. Now over here, I have a brackish tank, and I'm actually going to transform this into a good 38-gallon saltwater aquarium here. So for all you fish fans out there, I'm going to pick out some fish. Now you guys can help me, because I'm having... Because I want you guys to be happy too. I know for sure I'm going to have clownfish in there. But if you can think of other good fish to put in there that are reef safe and everything, I'm all up for it and I'll try and put them in there. Next, and the only thing in here is a puffer and an eel. They'll probably be in the saltwater aquarium. He's in there somewhere. You'll see this eel better. Then this is my predator saltwater aquarium where I have my wolf eel my porcupine puffer, my catfish, two chocolate chips, starfish, wherever the other one's at, and then one snowflake in there somewhere. He likes to hide. Yeah. And then in here I have Flame, Kevin, and uh, I haven't really named the other guy yet. I have another salamander in there. Feeding tank, all the goldfish that go in here. And then here's my piece the resistance tank it's still in the working progress uh, here is my 75 gallon reef aquarium packed with clownfish sailfin tangs chromises coral beauty dragon goby six line wrasse whatever this dragon goby went cleaner shrimp coral banded shrimp anything scooter blennies starfish everything that you want in a saltwater aquarium. Scooter Blenny! Mushrooms, Devil's Hand, uh, Feather Duster, a Shell, Brain Coral, Buttons, Mushrooms, that mushroom right there, Clownfish, Hosting the Anemone. Yeah, I'm gonna move this Anemone into the 38 gallon once it gets a little bit bigger. And then he'll, and then we'll get some more clownfish, put them in there, and host them. So he will get a hosting thing in there. But this is my piece of resistance aquarium. It's not completely done yet. I'm gonna still edit it. There's my yellowtail damsel, cleaner shrimp. Yeah, the glass needs cleaning. My starfish, other starfish, coral beauty again. And there should be. I don't know if we'll be able to find him my dragon goby and my uh, striped goby striped goby I can probably find uh, give me a minute hmm I must be behind the an enemy and I don't want to move it right now so yeah that's my 75 gallon reef and this is my freshwater aquarium where everything fresh goes I've got myself a blind cichlid he has no eyes, he's kind of cute. I got these Gromneys, some Tetras, some goldfish, coral, uh, Corys, my knife fish, he's awesome. Uh, fire eel should be in here somewhere, and my, there's the uh, loach. Where's my rope fish and my fire eel? Oh, there's the fire eel in the volcano. Kind of cool thing, he's in the volcano, cute. And then my rope fish, which is like the boss of the tank. You can see his head right there. He's about a good foot long. He's got everything. And then here's my quarantine system. My bluegill, I think it is. And quarantine, just only two more days and then he'll be out. And then my saltwater quarantine tank, which needs a change. But yeah, that's all my tanks. Uh, hopefully you like them. And hopefully we can get some more fish in here. Oh yeah, the starfish is now sticking on the glass. It took him a while, but yeah. And hopefully we can get some uh, good fish in here. Um, like and favor, or subscribe, and all that junk. I don't know. And um, if you want a fish to be on here, uh, just put a fish down there that you want to see. For sure there's going to be clownfish, and it's going to be reef, so you got to make sure it's reef safe and everything. But yeah. Um, that's it. Uh, hopefully you like this video, and I'll see you guys on a Claw Quest video um, at Dave & Buster's. I'll be going to Dave & Buster's pretty soon. It's probably going to be up in two weeks, maybe a week. 
So I'll see you guys then. Bye.